it's Shimin here and welcome back to my channel. So today as you guys can see by the title, we're going to be doing a little one-on-one -on -one shaving for our lovely lady downstairs. Today I like honestly just wanted to come to you guys and just share like techniques that I've learned um, to basically just prevent any like shaving bumps or anything like that. It's going to be super smooth, like baby butt smooth, okay? Um, super simple to do i'm not gonna like actually show you guys i'm just gonna demonstrate like what you would do in that situation and then um that's really it for this video make sure you guys give this video a thumbs up if you like it um subscribe to my channel for more videos to come and continue watching okay so the first thing um you guys are gonna want is a shaver you're gonna need baby oil or like some type of like lotion that you guys like to use and then optional is going to be like a body scrub um, so basically for me, I do use two separate shavers like in the shower. So I have like one shaver for my kitty and then I have two, like another shaver for like my arms and my legs and that one I will use the same on. Um, but just to keep the little girl downstairs clean, I just like to keep it like one shaver for her. Um, Okay guys, so basically all you're going to need for this is a shaver, some baby oil, or like some type of lotion moisturizer that you guys like to use, and then optional is going to be like a body scrub. So basically what you want to do is, um, and if you guys aren't already doing this, I definitely recommend it, but I always have two shavers in my shower, so one's going to be for my arms and my legs, and then I have one just for our lovely lady. Second thing is always get like a five blade, so this is like just some random shaver that i got from ross today uh, but basically just make sure it's five blades just gives you like um i've always just had better luck with using five blades rather than um like three blades or something because i feel like they just don't last as long um so definitely look at that to make sure it says five blades um and then basically what you're gonna want to do and this is a tip i actually just learned about not too long ago but um use like obviously you're gonna clean it you know clean your body you're scrubbing everywhere boom done um and i like to put conditioner on like so i'll just put some in my hand like so say if this was our our lovely lady our vagina um i just get like a little dot and i usually will do like in sections um but like the first area obviously you usually get like the surface of the vagina first i don't know that's me that's how i shave ain't gonna make a difference but honestly just get some conditioner and you're basically just gonna like rub it in um and then you want to shave and when you're shaving like the surface like if this is the surface this is the lip you're shaving the surface you don't want to like go like this or like go upwards or downwards because that's what's going to create like the the shaving bumps like those little bumps that you can get sometimes now i like honestly don't get that many but like i've just been like trying new things to get it like super like baby smooth and i've noticed that this helps so i just want to share it with you guys so what you're gonna want to do is like go this way so you want to go this way and then obviously if there's any other ones because your hair does grow in different ways that's what i was looking for um then you would obviously go this way um once that's done and you're like onto like the lip area obviously you'd apply a little bit more conditioner um and then i always just go up from the bottom of the lip to the top of the lip i'm trying to be as accurate as i can but hopefully you guys understand me but anyways so you just want to like go upwards towards like your stomach um, and then that's just gonna help, once again, avoid getting any, like, bumps while you're shaving in that area. Um, and then once that's all done, for the little back area, <laughs> I always go, like, under my legs. <laughs> um, if that makes sense. It's kind of hard to, like, explain and um but honestly like you know like when you're getting a wax or something and like they get the little butt area um i always will just like lift up a little butt cheek and then just kind of like go towards 
my stomach again. Um, I don't like to go the other way just because I feel like it's against how my hair grows. So, and that's just going to cause like sores and bumps and we're trying to prevent that. So, that's what you would do in that situation. Um, if you guys have like additional questions about that, leave in the comments below and maybe I'll like make a separate video for that or something. But really simple. Um, once that's all done, I like to go in with like a body scrub and what I've been using right now is just this like homemade body scrub lately I could eat this right now it's like coconut oil brown sugar sugar coffee like coffee grounds um, but basically but I just like to use this down there my lovely lady just to make sure that all the areas are super smooth clean fill them fresh and I mean if you guys have used scrubs like you know how your body be feeling afterwards like that should be gold like so you know the kitty deserves it too okay but after that obviously in the shower this is still in the shower you just put this on like kind of like smooth it in and when i smooth it in like i go in like a circular motion like i'm not just like scrubbing like this i like to be soft with it like you know just working in but take your time don't like rub it because obviously you're just gonna irritate your skin but um and then once that's done and I feel like I've rubbed it in enough, then I'll obviously wash it off I, out of the shower. And then, like, I use baby oil for, like, my moisturizer down there if I'm, like, or, like, coconut oil or something like that. But for this video, we're using baby oil, okay? Um, obviously, I've had this for a while. Like, it's all done, dead. Um, but basically, you could get, like, a tube like this at, like, the dollar store. I think I got this. It says write it so i think i got it from write it um but any type of like baby oil baby lotion something that's gonna moisturize the kitty you know that's what you want to use okay guys so that's it for today's video um once again this is just techniques that i've used over the couple years or like just recently picked up that i've noticed has helped kind of keeping my kitty really smooth and like avoiding getting bumps or anything like that um, so definitely leave in the comments below if you guys have any other tips that I missed or like you guys use different things that you like better. Um, and make sure you give this video a thumbs up and I will see you guys in my next video.